Okay, here we have two identical cups of coffee. Everything about these cups of coffee is the same, with one exception. They both had the same amount of grounds, the same amount of water, they were steeped for the same amount of time. They were both made in the same French press. Everything's the same, except that the cup on the left, the coffee was ground in this Cuisinart DBM-8 uh, electric burr mill coffee grinder. Whereas the cup on the right, the coffee was ground in this Mr. Coffee blade-based coffee grinder. Um, one reason people prefer uh, burr mill coffee grinders is that they give a more uniform size uh, particles with the grounds. So um, you get a more even extraction so you don't end up with a lot of bitterness. It ends up being a, a a better cup of coffee if you do everything right than you can generally get with a blade coffee grinder where you know you never know how many times the blade is going to hit a particular piece of coffee so you'll have some pieces that are you know big old chunks and some that are dust you know the proverbial boulders and dust as they say so you know the big pieces will be under extracted and the small pieces will be over extracted and it typically results in an inferior cup of coffee. Um, and another issue with French press is you're supposed to use a coarse grind. In both cases I used the coarsest setting, so it should be similar in general. Um, one reason you use a coarse setting or coarse grinds in a French press uh, is that French presses typically use a wire mesh filter like this one that you know, it's a pretty fine mesh, but still very, very small coffee particles can make it through there. So you end up with sediment in, your in the bottom of your glass. And uh, that doesn't really bother me too much, but some people really don't like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these two cups out and uh, pour them out into these bowls. And we'll see how much sediment is left in the bottom of each cup. Okay. So we'll start with the one made with the Mr. Coffee blade grinder um, grounds. So here we go. Okay, we're already getting down to the sediment. You can see there's quite a bit in there. Let's try the version made with the uh, Cuisinart burr mill grinder. Right, you can see there's definitely still some sediment, but it's not nearly as much as in the blade grinder cup. So, compare the two again. Definitely a lot more there. So, that's that. Um, if you're interested in either of these coffee grinders, I'll put a link down below this video where you can read more about each one, check out some reviews and such. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye.